Good evening, everybody. Uh, let's just go ahead and go right into prayer. Father, thank you so much for today and just the the beauty of this day. And Lord, I want to continue to, um, as we are heading toward the celebrating the 4th of July, I, I want to focus on praying for our nation again and praying for the, the needs of our nation. Lord, I know I, I prayed last night that you know, we are a mess as a nation. Uh, we we have problems that are certainly um, bigger than just uh, needing a, a little tweak here and or there. Um, we as a society are very broken. And Lord, I recognize that only you are the, the answer. We can work at trying to solve racial problems and trying to solve economic problems and trying to solve viral issues. But the reality is, is that um, at the heart of, of our needs and our problems are a need for you. And so, Father, that is my prayer again tonight, that you will draw people to yourself, that you will open their hearts to be receptive to you, and that people will come to understand that you are the answer. Uh, you know, it's not going to be solved by a political party or, or something like that. It's going to be solved by you. And so, Lord, I just pray that you will help Christians to act like Christians and help us to be genuine, honest reflections of Jesus. And then, Father, I pray that people's hearts um, who are not Christians will be drawn to you. Father, that is my prayer, and I just I ask in Jesus' name, amen. Thank you. Well, I hope you have a good evening. Good night.